Well, let's get you up to speed now on the stories you need to know to start your morning. Arizona continues to see hundreds of new coronavirus cases each day, but there are signs that the spread is slowing. As of yesterday's report from the State Department of Health, Arizona's positivity rate has held around 4% for seven consecutive weeks. That's more than 6% less than the total positivity rate, which was skewed by massive infection rates around our July peak. But the number of Americans who say they will get a COVID-19 vaccine are also thinning. A new poll shows only a little more than half of the country would try and get vaccinated. 51% of those surveyed said they would go for a vaccine if it was widely available at a low cost. That's a huge drop, though, from the 66% of people who said the same thing back in May. And millions of people are still waiting for their stimulus checks. And now the IRS says they're extending the deadline to get your money. The IRS relies mostly on tax returns to process the payments, but you don't have to have filed one to be eligible. So they created a special website to handle the claims. Now the agency is extending the October 15th registration deadline to November 21st. A link to the non-filers tool is prominently displayed on irs.gov. And now you're up to speed. Don't forget, you can always find the latest news on our website, 12news.com or the free 12 News app.